click on this subscribe button to watch more videos on my youtube channel and also click on this bell icon to get all notifications on your mail hi friends in this video i'm going to explain how to develop a bicycle in 2d first open the autocad and save the one of the file name i'm giving the one of the file name called bicycle 2d autocad like this you can give the type of the file type you can also change the file type to 2020 2010 or anything as your wish and this is the one of the file i created then you can observe on the screen this is the one of the file bicycle 2d autocad is created first i want to create the one of the layer over here and go into the layer properties and click on the layer new layer then after give the name of any of the name what you creating the uh, according to the drawing and you, you know, i am giving the bicycle frame i can observe on the screen and the bicycle screen one of the layer is created and select the bicycle frame i want to work on this uh, layer and you want to change the different layer you can also change the different and give the units units and click on enter then the, this is the command and the drawing units change it to millimeters and the unit is precision is zero i created and i want to create the one of the line to create the one of the frame and i am giving the ucs icon and click on no enter then icon will like this and you can observe the i am giving the one of the line and specify the next point and give the dimension of 600 mm i am giving the dimension of 600 you can see this is the 600 mm i created and go into the modify and uh, click on the oblique Uh, that is the dimensions are not visible i'm selecting the modified dimension style standard and go into the text height 50 and the symbol and arrow is also 50 and they go to the symbols and arrows and the arrows text size i'm giving to the 50 and click on okay you can see the 600 mm is shown and they go into the modify again i want to fit the primary units and go into the precision zero and click on okay and they click on course either this is the without the decimals the dimension will highlight you can observe on the 600 mm it is uh, there i want to create the another line over here you can observe the 600 of the uh, horizontal line is created i want to the some of the inclined line of vertical like some of the inclined i created and i, I give the 70 degree angle of angular you can see i'm giving the 70 degree of the angle this is the line is 70 degree and this line is the reference line you want to delete you can also delete i'm deleting this reference line the 70 degree position of the frame i want to copy this to the another uh, place also on the left side on the two right and the left is 70 degree of the one of the angle is created then after you can observe the two copy objects you can observe the 70 degree and the 70 degree i want to give the one of the reference line of 500 of dimension of mm and click on the dimension and click on the linear al aligned you can observe the uh, the dimension is 500 you can observe the line is 500 of the reference line then after what to do to do the frame i want to again give the one of the reference line like this of the any of the dimension this is the horizontal and the one of the vertical line is created again i am trimming the lines of the 500 of only i want the 500 height of this and you can observe that this is the 500 and you can observe the one of the two inclined lines of 500 height is created by using the reference line by using the trim command and you can observe the 600 mm of the horizontal line and the inclined line of 70 degree and the 70 degree this is the reference line over here you can observe that this is the reference line and i want to create the again i want to extend this to the line and also delete and delete the line of the reference line and after i want to create the 500 what i created this is the 500 height then after i am giving the one of the line of the reference line of one of the horizontal line of uh, uh, i'm giving the 500 distance and 500 and click on enter you can observe the line i'm the height i'm giving the 100 dimension and you can observe the 100 and the 500 horizontal and vertical line two lines are created then after i will show the dimensions also 100 and the 
and the 150 you can observe on the screen and you can observe this i am the inclined line touched to this the position of two inclined lines of one to the another you can observe this the one of the triangle type of 70 degree i get the 70 degree by using the 500 mm and the 100 dimension and deleting the reference by using the 500 and the 100 i get the 70 degree exact what i done on the left side is the one of the triangle is created like this and you can observe the of the height of the reference line i am giving the reference line to extend to this to the 500 to the 400 and what is the 100 line i created onto the reference line and selected and and you can observe the one of the i created the what the line i created that the line i deleted and click on the save option this is the 70 degree angle over here and you can observe that i am deleting the line of the, this is the reference line i am deleting though the this is the frame is developed by using the 70 degree on the other side and the 70 degree on the right side and the left side and you want to create the circle of uh, this is called the tire of i am giving the 500 diameter of the two circles of 500 diameter c enter you can also copy this object and you can also the reference line and select to the line to this of i am giving again the 500 mm of dimension then after i give the 500 diameter the two circles of 500 diameter you can observe on the screen this is the 500 and the 400 distance of height and the 400 i want to offset to this to the 25 mm of the 550 diameter and click on the offset command and you can also give the command of offset and object to the offset to 25 mm it is called 550 of um, diameter of 200 mm i giving the pedal object you can observe the pedal uh, gear is i'm giving the 200 dia and this is the 70 degree i'm moving little bit to the higher of 70 degree this is the 70 and the 70 see the exact of the frame i created by using the dimensions of exact you can observe the two tires i created on the middle one of the tire of the frame hole i created of 50 mm and on the other side also i'm giving the same of dimension of 50 mm and you can observe the one of the circle is created i and go to the radius of uh, 200 diameter i given i want to change the diameter to 150 and click on ok and you can observe the 150 looking good and you observe the tides are created you want to color the change and change the layer properties i will show the uh how to give the lines and click on the line option and give the one of the line of the vertical to the uh, in between of the tire and you can observe the one of the line you created and array or command is needed and array object and select that object and select the polar and then after select the axis and of rotation of items is i'm giving the six items one two three four five six items created you can observe and the double click on that you want to change the uh, items and double click on that object i'm giving the 25 items over here this looking good and you can observe the the frame of uh, is created with the small rods you can observe the i'm copying this object to the other side also see how the 2d model is created by using the these uh, dimensions you can observe the i want to give the properties and you want to change the any of the color and uh, render the object in the good by use on the printout and what to do and i will explain and select the hatch command and hatching the other of the objects of so the first and the second you can select the hatch of the tire i want to change the color to any of the color to blue i am going to the properties of that on the double click and go into the bilayer and go into the blue and the color i selected to bilayer to color you can observe the two is converted to blue and i'm giving to the again i'm giving to the cyan and you can observe the this color is converted into and the white i want to convert it to the green color and selecting the all of the lines and click on the uh, properties or right click and go into the yellow or green and i'm creating the green color and you can observe the different uh, colors i apply it looking good and you can observe the 600 of the height in between the distance is enough exact of the dimension and you can observe the i want to give give the layer properties you want to give the layer properties uh, the individual optics for on and off i will explain that also in this tutorial and you can observe this also the 400 you can also check the dimension and click on the linear option you can also check the 
in between to the tie to the center to the center of the tie this is cc by cc by 1063 the 1 meter nearly 1 meter of the center of the to the center and you can observe i am going to the object snap settings in clear all and the select all this should be in the select all to creating any of the dimension and you can observe the 400 and the 600 70 70 and the 1063 I want, I want i want all show the radius also i want to give the radius and click on the radius or diameter i'm giving the diameter of 150 and it is okay and i'm giving the 550 offset to 25 that is called 550 and the 550 500 is the circle dimension these are the dimensions i shown on the 2d model you can observe on the screen and this is a different linear and the aligned also you can give the aligned of the inclined lines you can also inclined lines uh, highlight by using the aligned uh, annotation and these are the dimensions i mentioned to develop this and you can observe the layer properties the bicycle frame i created i never created them uh um, this uh, tire frame of the layer how to create this this is a before after also we can create the layer how we i will show you and turn the current layer off that all will off i want to highlight the tires and other side i want to highlight the frame this is the bicycle frame i want to highlight to the tires and the bicycle tires i'm giving here you can observe the mice on the right side on the screen and the bicycle tires and after the bicycle tires I want to create the bicycle tides frame on, and select the tides, the first and the second. Select the two tides of with the frame, and click on the double click on or by side click on that, right click and properties, and go into the layer and select the convert the layer to the bicycle tides. You can observe these two tides are converted into the bicycle tides layer. I will show the layer properties and go into the bicycle frame. and click on the current layer off you can observe the the tires are currently off and the frame is highlighted you can observe on the screen you want to give the frame highlighted and select the tires off like this you can do by using the layers you can easily identify the object by using the layer properties you want to create the any of the drawing first create by using the layers method it will help you this is the professionally you uh, you can identify the all of the parts what you drawn and you can also easily edit by using the layer properties the properties will uh, so much is helpful not okay